this is already looking and smelling so good it smells like you can already eat it hey guys welcome back to the channel and in today's video i will be showing you guys how to prep some very delicious cornmeal porridge so firstly i have my natural cinnamon leaves i'm going to go right ahead and wash these have some sticks as well wash these nicely I won't be using the tap water so I'm going to add the cinnamon leaves and sticks to the pot and then add some water we're not making a lot so that is it We're going to allow this to come to a boil to infuse those natural flavors from the cinnamon. Based on the amount that we're making, we're going to add just a little bit of salt and allow that to come to a boil. While the water is boiling, add some cornmeal to a clean bowl. Given we're not making a lot, we don't want to add too much cornmeal because the cornmeal is going to, of course, swell. Then we're going to add some water, just a little, and mix this into a paste. I can smell the aroma coming from the, the boiling cinnamon leaves. So in this now we're going to add a tablespoon of vanilla and mix. I'm going to also add a one scoop coconut powder or you can use the coconut milk the natural coconut milk or any other milk of your choice and mix that in you don't want to smell this aroma it smells so delicious this is already looking and smelling so good it smells like you can already Eat it. So now that wow that smells so good. We want to have a whisk readily available while we gradually pour our cornmeal mixture in and we want to start whisking right away because we don't want any clumps so we start whisking right away see that start to thicken up already so we're going to go in with we're going to add a cup of water to this bowl and then we pour it in That's approximately one cup. And we're going to mix and ensure that everything is out. On low flame, we're going to cover and allow that to simmer. And you can use the same bowl. Just catch some water and have your whisk ready. Just as a okay so after a few minutes you can definitely go ahead and do a taste test and know if you need to add anything else i'm going to go in with some more vanilla and i'm adding two two tablespoons 
and you definitely have to top that off with some fresh freshly grated nutmeg I'm going to also add some sweetened condensed milk not a lot but just for flavor and to add some amount of sweetness not too sweet and, and then we're going to just whisk and infuse all of that great flavor that smells so delicious if you prefer yours a little bit more liquidified then you can add more milk or more water whichever of your choice and i'm going to go right in with some more milk and then mix that in Whoa. Cover on low to medium or medium to low flame and allow that to cook for about 10 to 15 minutes. Serve and enjoy.